Hello everybody, how are you doing? Welcome to a new tutorial. My name is Mint. Hello! I hope you're having a fantastic day and you really love this tutorial that I have for you today. Don't forget about my giveaway! <laughs> where you can win this amazing prize. These are the beautiful Distroller Neonet Babies. The only thing you need to do is to subscribe to this channel, Mindalia, and to subscribe to Distroller's channel, Distroller USA. That's all you need to do to have the possibility of winning this beautiful prize. I'm gonna leave these rules in my pinned comment and also in the description box. If you want one more opportunity to win this prize, you can leave me a comment telling me why you love this toy. I love you a lot and I just can't wait to start with the tutorial. And good luck everyone! In this tutorial, we are gonna make one LOL surprise and a miniature. <laughs> and you can also download everything that I'm using as a template from a link that I'm gonna leave in one of my pinned comments. That way your dolls can have a beautiful LOL surprise for themselves. It's time to get started. The first thing we're gonna use for this tutorial is this type of boxes and this size, this is the small one, is the perfect size for LOL surprise doll. <laughs> At least for the bigger surprise that we are doing today. And this is the surprise that we are doing today. It's really fun to make and I know you will love to make this bigger surprise for your dolls. The first thing we need to do is to open the box and we need to clean it really really well. And we are gonna paint the box with pink acrylic paint. When all the box is completely painted with pink acrylic paint, we are gonna let it dry and we are gonna start working. What we need to do is to cut everything that we, <laughs> that we have here. Now that we have everything cut, we are going to start with what I think is the easiest part. I have some bits. I really like this package because it has different sizes. These are plastic bits. We are gonna use it for the surprise balls, for the little sister and the big sister and the pet. We only need four. And the only thing we need to do is to cover everything with this paper. First, we are going to glue the design that doesn't have anything on it, just plain pink. And the design that has the miniature LOL surprise is going to be on top, like this. something like this we are done we just need three more I have these plastic capsules you can open and close them let's cut it just a little bit to make it smaller let's close it one more time now we have this size. This is the perfect size to make the miniature version of the LOL Surprise under wraps. The only thing that we need to do is to cover the capsule with this paper. But before that we are going to paint the inside of the capsule with pink acrylic paint. While we are waiting for it to dry, we are gonna add some glue to the box and also add a little bit of glitter to the box. We need to cover everything. Don't forget to cover all around the side as well. We should end up with something like this. It's looking really cute. We let it dry and we keep working. 
Now it's time to make the blind boxes for these miniature clothes that I printed. And for that we are gonna use a modeling clay. We are gonna place the clay on the back of a brush and we start modeling the box any way that you like. We cut the excess. We take it out, really careful. We want to have a really nice box. Now that we have everything ready, it's time to start placing everything inside the bigger surprise. I made a miniature version of a wig with some cotton. <laughs> it's really cute. I also made another wig. This one is smaller with clay as well so you can use cotton or yarn anything really that you want to use and well the miniature wigs we are gonna place them inside the miniature capsules that we did before we are going to start working on assembling everything that is going to be inside the bigger surprise and we are almost done with the tutorial Now to this hot pink paper that we have here, we are going to place the six pieces or boxes that we did at the back of the paper. Don't forget that this is the paper that we are going to tear in order to reveal the clothes that we have for the dolls. But before we glue the box, don't forget to add the paper clothes that we printed inside the boxes before gluing the box to the paper. Now we are going to take this design that I have here and we are going to glue the capsules as that we did. We are going to glue four to the paper. Now we are going to take this last design that we have on the template and we are going to glue the four surprises that we did in this video. Like this. We are going to take our box and we are going to start adding everything that goes inside the bigger surprise. We close the beautiful box that we did and we just need to glue one last <laughs> label <laughs> and don't forget to add one handle because we want it to be as close to the original as possible and also this way you can take it anywhere you want and this is the LOL Surprise, a bigger surprise in miniature form. Perfect size for LOL Surprise dolls. And well guys, this is the final result. I really hope you have enjoyed this video. It was really fun to make. Let me know in the comments if you want me to make more miniature videos. I know you love my last video, so let me know if you want me to continue doing miniatures and unboxings and stories. Don't forget that if you make any of my tutorials, I would love to see your pictures. Just follow me on Instagram at Mindalia. <laughs> If you love this tutorial, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and be part of the beautiful Mint family. I love you a lot. And also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you can participate on my giveaway. I'm giving away one stroller. The only thing you need to do is to subscribe to the channel Mindalia and to subscribe to the Strollers USA channel as well. You can leave me comments, you can leave comments on the Strollers channel if you want. Don't forget that you are awesome, that I love you a lot and you mean the world to me. I will see you soon. Bye bye!